welcome back to my channel so I just took a shower did my base makeup and I thought that I would come on camera and do a little get ready with me um, and testing out some new products um, so yeah if you're interested in the get ready with me and seeing new products <laughs> stay tuned today I am going to be using the light speed eyeshadow palette by bad habit it's super pretty I recently hauled this from Shop Hush. It was really, really cheap. Super cheap. And then I'm also going to be using the Unicorn Glow Palette. This is a highlight palette by Face Candy. It has those really fun, colorful highlights. I'm probably going to dip into the blue one. This one down here. Um, because I think I'm going for a very blue look today. So, yeah. So, for my base makeup, I'll just, like, tell you guys what I used if you're interested. Um, but yeah, so I just used, um, for primer, I used this Ulta, not Ulta, Lush primer thing. I don't really know. I need to buy it. It's, it's a tester. Um, but that's what it says. If you can read it, that's the primer that I used. And then for foundation, I just used my Fenty Beauty foundation. I love this stuff. It's so good, guys. If you haven't tried Fenty foundation yet, like, what are you doing? Go try it. For concealer, I just used the LA Girl Concealer. It's like not a super full coverage concealer, but it's just right if you need just like a little bit of extra stuff. Um, I used my NYX Brow Mascara as usual. I love this stuff, but the Ulta Brow Tint is also super good if you are looking for a brow, like tinted brow gel or brow mascara type of thing. And then I just used my Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powder. My lid for my pressed powder that I'm using right now is like literally broken in two pieces so they, this is the lid this is the powder it's just Rimmel Stay Matte it's been around for like literally forever almost everyone has at least used it once um if not you should probably try it because it's actually really good and it's like the only powder I use and then I just used um my baked bronzer by Jcat Beauty it's my broken one from Hush um, it's like super duper broken. It's really broken, guys. <laughs> I should just buy a new one. Um, Hush refunded me. They didn't send me a new one. I just wanted the bronzer. But I'm probably going to buy a new one of these and maybe this other bronzer. I don't know. I don't really have that many bronzers. Um, but yeah, so that is my base makeup. Let's get into the eyeshadow and highlight. <laughs> so there aren't like too, too many color choices here, but I think it's still going to come out really nice looking. So I'm going to take this color right here and I'm just going to put that all over my lid up to my brow bone as kind of a base color. crease oh man decisions I'm first gonna dip into this really vibrant blue here and then following that I'm going to dip into this um like deeper blue right here and blend those out in my crease
I am going to take that color with the, the, the deeper color, not the lighter color, um, with this end of my brush and I'm just going to sweep that along my lower lash line. brush and I'm going to dampen it. Oh my gosh! I'm going to dampen it with some setting spray. Oh, well, let me show you what color I'm going to use first. Um, I'm going to go in with... But it looks pretty, so I'm going to use that all over my lid. Um, and as I said, I'm just going to dampen this uh, brush with some setting spray and then dip into that and put it all over my lid. Um, I'm gonna go in with some eyeliner or maybe mm, no I'm just gonna put on mascara um, this mascara is just like the Ulta brand mascara I don't know if they have different kinds I got it for free so I'm gonna try it out oh my god okay maybe this isn't the best idea Okay, so now that I have applied mascara, um, we're going to go in with my Unicorn Glow Palette. So I am actually going to, like, I'm going to try this. Some people do this. I don't do this. Um, but I'm going to try setting my face and then doing the highlighter, so hopefully it'll stick better and be more pigmented. So hopefully I didn't just get mascara on my under eye. I don't see any. Okay, so I'm going to go in with my highlight brush and use that blue shade, like I said. And I'm going to highlight. lot of blue on my nose. <laughs> uh, I didn't really mean to do that. I'm just going to pick up some of my setting powder again and just kind of blend my nose. I'm cool with that. Alright, I'm going to set my face one more time. Guys, if you guys don't have the Morphe setting spray, oh, it's so good. This is honestly my first bottle. I had never had it before, and I honestly love it. All right, so because we have such a blue uh, eyeshadow look, we're probably going to go with more of a neutral lip. So... So we're gonna do Whirl by Mac because I always wear Whirl. I have a problem. I 
am just going to pop a gloss on top of Whirl. So this is um, the lip gloss that comes in the Ariel set from the Disney Designer Collection from ColourPop. I really like this color. So I'm just going to pop it right on top of the lipstick. So I'm just going to talk about the palettes really quickly. I think the light's bad. <laughs> light's bad? Okay. Light speed palette. I really actually like. I think it's really nice. I think it has a nice variation of colors. I think you can do several looks with it. Um, and it's super affordable. So I think that this is a yes. Um, it was pretty easy to blend. Uh, the shimmers are, su are super creamy. Um, I really like it. So A+. plus. The highlight palette. I'm... I'm cool with it. I don't, I obviously only tried the blue, um, but I definitely like that. It's very fun and has a good amount of pigment and I think it looks really good. I've never worn, uh, colored highlights before, but I bought this one and I also bought a mermaid glow palette. So they're all colorful and I'm excited. I think it's going to be a lot of fun to try some new things and try colored highlighters. So yeah, looking forward to it, but I like that too. So, uh, a plus again. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that kind of concludes this video. So if you liked it, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. It means so much to me and leave your comments down below. I always reply. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, please click that subscribe button. And if you want to get notified when I upload new videos, click that bell next to the subscribe button. And um, I'll see you guys next time. Okay, bye!